This is an attunement service this morning, as it is week by week. So we're attuning to something. We're tuning in. Felt that profoundly through what we've been doing. Can you feel us tuning in together to something? The initial stages of that tuning in for us make it seem like we're touching into something that's separate from us. Here we are as a human being, and we're touching into the spiritual. We're attuning to spiritual source by whatever name, and you can choose your name as far as I'm concerned. We're tuning into something different. But actually, the attunement process begins with that, but it doesn't end with it. If we're truly attuning to something, what happens? What happens? If the process goes all the way through, we are opening to it. We're receiving something from it. We're not just admiring love off in the distance in another person, in a story. No, we are feeling it. We're attuning to it. And in that attunement, we are receiving. We're opening ourselves to receive that love into ourselves. And you might say that's more than half the battle for us as human beings the way we get. No? Like, as human beings, we can get shut down and not know we're shut down. Like, there's creative juice that wants to find us and enter us and be in our soul, but we're shut down. We're not letting it in, and we don't even know it. So the first step in all that is to receive and to take deliberate steps to open ourselves to receive. And when we do receive, it comes into us, and then it starts to work on us. It does it not. When we let love in, it starts to work. It starts to change us. And at some point, it wants out. We're feeling these feelings towards other people in the world that we hadn't felt in the same way before, or at least perhaps not for a long time. My point is that the process of attunement is actually a process of becoming. And it is a process of becoming what we're attuning to. So if we are attuning to love, over time, as love comes into us and comes out through us, we are becoming that. We're becoming one with that love, not something different. And our humanity is taken up into an expression and embodiment of that love. 